Hello, Groove here. I'm going to show you a little trick you can do um, with mouse acceleration and how it's going to help you to track like you're playing on a low sensitivity and 180 flick like you're playing on a high sensitivity uh, and combine the two so it feels natural. Now, for years I've played um, the likes of Battlefield, Counter-Strike, games where you just kind of holding an angle, not really doing an, a lot of 180 flicks, Rainbow Six Siege especially, where you're just, you know, holding a little pixel peak and not really doing one 180 degree movements. Now, there's two, two programs I'm going to, before I go on, there's two programs you can do. If you don't have a Steel Series engine um, mouse, then don't worry about it. You can use Raw Excel, which is totally legit to use. It's not cheating. It's a sign driver. It's just a, basically a better way of adjusting your acceleration than in your Windows settings. Um, this is used by a lot of pro players. Sure 4 uses it. Um, uh, in Overwatch, but a lot of pro plays in Counter-Strike and other Valorant and everything. Um, it's a great program um, to get into to use for um, uh, any other mouse. You can, you might even prefer to use it over the Steel Series engine. Um, but I've been trying with 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 this program here. It's a lot easier to explain with this program, especially now. So. Let's say I'm playing McCree and I have my sensitivity set up the same, just like Chats was saying, to get that muscle memory, which is a good thing. You want to, between all heroes, you want to make sure your aim in your muscle memory is really dialed in. So let's see, with keeping my crosshair locked onto this bot here on 400, all right, if I want to do that on 800, it, it's a, it's a bit harder, all right. I've got to do smaller micro adjustments. Uh, I've I've got to I've really got to work harder to to do that. Okay, than if I was on the lower sensitivity of 400. But to do a 180 degree flick with my mouse pad, which is about the size of my arm, it's I've got to. I've got to go the whole length of my mouse pad. Okay, so I'm going from here all the way to here. But on 800, obviously, I'm only have to go half that. So I can do those 180 flicks on 800 a lot easier than if I was to do that whole mouse pad movement. Like I'm used to doing that. But when you're playing Tracer or Genji, it's a it's a lot of work and it's uh, not always as accurate trying to do that large flick. So the way to combine these two, so that I have the tracking of 400, okay? I want the tracking of 400, but I also want the flicking of 800 in one setting. What I can do is bring my acceleration up so that so you can see the speed of hand movement versus sensitivity so my sensitivity when it's all the way when this acceleration is all the way up my 400 sensitivity becomes 800 when I go faster so when I move my if you look at my cursor down here when at the moment the way this is set up is if I move my hand at this speed I'm on 400 then when I move my hand this speed I'm on 800 okay so what that means is I can fine-tune this so that it feels natural for when I'm doing these flicks so now I'm on a roll this is my acceleration here all right so it's going up by so I'm on like another say 200 all right so at the moment so there's 400 when I'm tracking see it still feels like 400 because my mouse is going slow 
I'm not doing this. Alright. So the acceleration hasn't kicked in. But the second I flick, I'm on 800. Alright. That's what acceleration does. Um, I've got to play around with deceleration yet. Which, because um, I've only just started using the Steel Series engine. Um, but that's how it can really benefit you for this this game. Like, especially if you're using Tracer. Um, uh, where the hell's Tracer? Over here. So if you're playing Tracer and you need to do those 180 flicks behind people all the time, you want to be able to do that, you know. Shoot. Shoot. Uh, which you can't really on 400 like that's a lot of mouse movement so using acceleration I can still be 400 accurate but 800 flicking okay or in this case 600 flicking so thanks for watching and give it a try I'll make a link in the description for raw Excel and um, how to set it up and uh, let me know in the comments if it's helped you or if you um, need a help with any of this setting it up or any questions in general about uh, mouse acceleration and I'm happy to help. Uh, just let me know if uh, this has helped you or what your thoughts on acceleration are and um, thanks for watching. Bye.